Good balanced golf swing there by the big guy. From Surrey, England, please welcome Paul Casey. Land in that first third, let it chase back to that hole, up the slope. Same thing. Didn't sound right. Oh, got it to roll out though. Yeah, that was nice. Maybe it wasn't supposed to sound right. Has made its way to the second here. First of our two featured groups on PGA Tour Live. Mark Leishman. No, it's not eight. 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 And a little short. Crawl up the hill. There it is right there. And that is very well judged. Other featured group has moved ahead to the third. Just a positional par four at 403 yards. Leishman at the third. Ball just slightly below the level of his feet. You can see him trying to drift it in there and uh, excellent, oh. excellent iron shot. Not much to read there. 500 plus yard par four. Well, I think the bunker down the left-hand side is a great sight line for Leishman. Likes to work the ball left or right. At the fourth, here's Leishman. Hit a beautiful iron shot back at three. Froze it right up against the whole location. And here at the fourth, 497 yards. Another good iron shot. Here's Leishman to tie for the lead. Well, this would be three under through four, and this would be the dream start here at Conway Farms. Now we're ready at the fifth. Co-leader, Leishman. Yeah, a little bit of a pull right there. Hang on. And this time the cut did not cut. Drew a great line in the rough, Brian. A lot of golf ball showing right there. The fronts of the greens are open, but you see the back of the green shaved down also. Also putter from off the green. And one long, one short. Well, there you go. Amazing how good these guys can be. Now, Leishman, a little bump and run here, Paul. Yeah, trying to chase it up. Not a lot of green to work with there, and that was nicely judged. Now, Leishman coming off the birdie. Long par five here today. Just under 600 yards. Ooh, that is perfect. That was nicely done. Try to carve it in there left to right. Pins in the back left hand corner at 264 obviously has plenty of distance to get there. Well, he's on the surface, Billy, but at the Travelers, he was two and a half hours ahead of Charlie Hoffman. Uh, great birdie, so Leishman now moves to minus four. 400 yards, just a little over 400 yards, 406 today. and. You can see the five birdies with the one lone bogey on the par three sixth and perfectly positioned. He has just now gone into a tie for the lead. Keegan Bradley has made a bogey and Leishman will have that to take the lead. Most of that movement's going to be at the end as it dies. Stay up ball. Are you kidding me? Leishman at the 10th. Unleashing his driver. So bunkers up the left about 380. There's nothing in the middle of the fairway though, but a golf ball. Got to get there. Oh. Yeah, beautiful par three. Wind's a little bit in here. So at 63, you're playing low 70s. Ooh, that was just <laughs> enough. At 11, Leishman for birdie. Just right back up the hill. Oh, wow, he is on cruise control. That little wiper happens. At the 12th, our leader. Softly. Softly. 
Another really short par four here, only 406 yards. And Our leader at the 12th, Mark Leishman. Well, he's been locked in with those shorter irons today. Oh, and he's done it again. After a great iron shot in there, of course he's going to make it. That's what he does. Rolling today, there's no need to take any unnecessary risk. So he's just going to be looking for his favorite wedge yardage, and this is right down the pipe. Mark Leishman saw how Paul Casey chose to get it close, going behind the hole here. We'll see what he does. Oh, and he's done the same thing. This is going to be good. Just a little slider here to the right, and he gets a 10th birdie of the day. Couldn't have a better scenario here. A little right to left wind that he can hold his cut up against. Leaning like it might be a little right. Yeah, a little right, about eight feet right. What another fantastic shot. And you see 220 yards, the whole location on the left. Said it before, very accessible. Only one birdie here today. So far, that was Keegan Bradley. Leishman would have his work cut out for him. Shotlink tells us this is 76 feet, two inches. It is indeed the longest putt of the day. That would have been for his 11th birdie. This from about nine feet for par, so to avoid a second bogey of the day, perfectly done. His low score on the PGA Tour in all his career, 62. Needs a birdie here to break that. This is left, well Whoa. left. Whoa. Ooh, and that is some of the thickest gunge here at Conway Farms. And he has done just that. He'll have a lengthy third, but still have a third. During Jake's takes, we'll have a little bit more on those two, Mark and Merle. <laughs> so fantastic. third shot for Leishman. He's going to have a chance five. for that lowest ever round. Makes that 61. And this is just going to go downhill and work slightly to his right. Now we're definitely giving him full credit for what he's done today. Even if he doesn't birdie the last. He has that for a nine under par 62. Okay. So Mark Leachman sets the pace. Does anybody have it in him to catch him at nine under par?